This is last game, I think only 18 tonight. Uh, how have they dragged you into this type of offensive game, and, and how do you guys kind of try to bust out and, and get back to your game? I think, you know, um, you know, tonight I think we moved the ball better than we have. And, and I think we figured something out on the offensive end tonight, which would be good for us going, you know, good moving forward in this series. Uh, but we just got to continue to play our game. You know, they're playing that style of defense for a reason. But like I said, I think we got to more of what we want to get to tonight as opposed to the previous games. Christy Reekin from the Associated Press. Draymond, with the kind of offenses that both of these teams have, can you just talk about the defense and how it's kind of been a defensive battle through these past two games? Uh, well, yeah, I think both teams have played really good defense out of the past two games, and that's what you expect. You know, it's the time of year where we know what they're doing, they know what we're doing. Uh, you just got to – make plays. Um, last two games down the stretch, they've been able to make a couple more plays than us. That's why they've been able to come out with the wins. But, you know, we're right where we need to be as far as giving ourselves a chance to win the game, and we'll pull through. Hey, Draymond, to your right, Phil Barber, Santa Rosa, Press Democrat. Um, what was supposed to happen on that final possession and, and how to get away from you? We were supposed to score. <laughs> and, uh, I lost the ball. It's kind of not much more to it than that. You know, we wanted to get the ball to Steph. We got the ball to Steph. Um, and he hit ahead of me and I fumbled the ball. So, nothing more, nothing less. Draymond Harden missed all 11 three-point shots, so so much was on Chris Paul. And he was able to draw bigs on him in isolation all game long. And it didn't matter who Steve put in, he just kept drawing that guy and hitting shots. What did you make of, of his ability to hit shots late in the clock in isolation? And I think he made some tough shots. Um, you got to give him a lot of credit. You know, he got the isos. We were good with the defense that our guys played on him. Um, he just made tough shots in key moments. Uh, kept them, you know, where they were struggling offensively, he kind of carried them and kept them afloat. So you got to give him some credit. Uh, nonetheless, he shot six for 19, you know. It was just a big six. So it's, you know, it's fine. I think we continue to play that same defense, try to make him take tough shots as we did. You got to live with the results. And he limped off the floor at the end. He's got a right hamstring injury. If he can't go for the rest of the series, how does that change it? That's not our focus. Uh, we got to prepare like he's going to play. You know, he's a great player. Um, right in the middle of everything they do. We're not going to come out and, you know, go back home and say, oh, man, Chris Paul ain't playing. Like, that's... That's their focus and not ours. Ours is to prepare as if he's playing. And, you know, if he not if he's not, then, you know, we got to make an adjustment. But I'd rather adjust to him not playing uh, as opposed to trying to adjust to him playing. Draymond, Dan Wecky with the Los Angeles Times. You guys have been in situations in the past where you guys have faced elimination. Do you find confidence in that, or, or is it the confidence coming from what you're seeing on the court, like you said, the, the defense, the improved ball movement? Where where exactly is this confidence down three two coming from? Um, um, I mean, I just think that's who we are. You know, we know what we're capable of. We know we can win two games. Uh, and you know, obviously, I think you know, in a sense of you've been there before is always you know a good feeling. Um, you know what it takes. And then you know, with what we've put out there on the floor the last two games, it could easily been two wins. And so we understand that. We know the things that we can improve on. And, and we'll improve on those things. Draymond, Ron Krejcik in the San Francisco Chronicle. Steph and Clay were both scoreless in the first quarter. They seemed to kind of find their touch in the middle of the game. When they did, how much did you feel like the ship had been righted? And, and as sort of a corollary to that question, Steph's shot near the end, that bank shot, what did you see in that play? It looked like you had a, a decent look for him. Uh, I mean, great look. I'll live, you know, I'll live with that look any day. Um, you know, like you said, both of those guys were able to find their shots. Um, you know, as, as the game, you know, got further along. And that's great for us moving forward. Um, you know, but that's that's never a worry of whether, you know, those guys are going to find their shots or not. You know, we're going to live and die with them taking the shots that they take. And I got a, you know, lot of confidence in us living rather than dying. So, you know, we'll be fine. But those two guys will be fine as well as they were tonight.